We'll guide you through how to set up the Ticket Toolbar in Discord. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, open up your web browser and come to tickettool.xyz and click on Invite Ticket Tool and go and invite it. Now you can come and return to Discord. Go to the top left and click on the server name and click on server settings. Select roles on the left. And what you want to do is make sure the ticket tool is above member roles, but you can make it below the owner and moderator roles. And what you want to do is create a role for support staff. So click on create role and you can then go and name it support. And you can then go and choose the members who have this role. After you've done that, you can close out of the settings, come over to the left and right click in the categories and channels, click on create category and go and name it support. What you can then do is go and create a channel within that. So we'll go and name that support as well and press create channel. Now all you need to do is come back to your web browser and go back to the site. Go and click on manage servers and log in with Discord. Find your server and go and click on manage. And you need to go and create a panel. So click on create one and name it. Then click on create. Now go into general here and you need to choose the support team roles. We have one called support and you can then click on save. Then press back and you want to go into category and you need to go and choose the category where we named our support, press save. You can then press back and then all you need to do is go and click on send up here and you can then choose the channel where you want it to be. In this case, you want it to be the support channel and click on send. Now you can come back to Discord and the message has now been sent. Now what I like to do is I like to just go and disable messaging in this channel. So click on edit channel and go into permissions and go and scroll down and you can turn off send messages and click save. Now when a user comes in here, they can click on the button and a ticket will then go and be created. Now because I'm part of the support role, I can then go and reply to it. And also the user who opened it can as well. And once you've finished, you can then go and close it. 